Hey guys, it is Sunday night. It is seven o'clock. Yep, seven o'clock. We are headed to a late night grocery shopping session um, to hopefully get enough food for the next two weeks or so. I have my mask here, so I will be wearing that in the store. I have one for Bob. We'll see if he'll actually relent to wear it or not. Um, I haven't vlogged all day. I've been um, just working on the eyeball journal and stuff around the house, a nice chat with my sister and niece and stuff like that. Kind of a chill Sunday. I'm okay with that. All right, we're gonna go get some shopping done. We'll see how empty the shelves are or aren't. I'll be back. Okay, we're back in the car. I feel safe enough to do this. Um, that was pretty successful. So we went to the Safeway in Sherwood and got everything on our list. Of course, they don't have any toilet paper, Clorox wipes or Lysol spray. But those are hit hit and miss anymore. So you, you either find them or you don't. Um, I don't have my seatbelt on. So uh -huh. we're good on all those three of those things at the moment. But when we are out shopping, if I see some, then I'll get an extra one just to not deplete our stash of what we do have. Um, but we got everything else. We should be good on groceries now for at least a week and a half, right? If not, hopefully two weeks. Hopefully two weeks. Hopefully. Um, if it was Bob and I, we'd probably good, be good for like a month with what we bought, but yeah. we've got two 25 year old teenagers at the house. So they're always hungry. They're oh yeah, Polly, they especially. It's like having a 16 year old boy in the house. Um, anyway, so we're gonna head home now and we'll be back. what happens when you're trying to hold the camera one-handed. Hey everybody, it's Monday afternoon. It's about 1.15 or so p.m. Um, Monday, March 30th. I'm headed out to go get the mail and <clears throat> I've been doing chores this morning and video editing and stuff like that. I haven't gotten any artwork done yet today because I've been working on all the April videos. I'd like to get them knocked out today. I have two more eyeballs to do in the eyeball journal and it is done. I was going to try to get it done over the weekend. That didn't happen. I am going to try to get it done today. It is on my goal list. So anyway, that's a thing. What else? Okay, guys, right or wrong, one of the few things I feel that I can do without a mask is go walking with the husband and the dog, especially because more often than not, there's nobody around and hasn't been in a while. I live in a very quiet community. Anyway, I think I'm pretty safe. While we're out tonight, we're gonna to drop off some painted rocks. It is raining a little bit, so I don't know how far we're gonna get, but we'll find out. I'll be back. Okay, it is wet and we, we're getting wet, but I've got two more rocks to give away. We might not make it to the library box, but we're gonna drop these off somewhere. There's a couple of neighborhood houses that I really enjoy their kids' sidewalk chalk art and things like that. So I've been leaving rocks on the porch and we're going to find two more places and then we're going to turn around and head back. The next time we come out, I'll bring some more with me because I made, I don't know, a couple dozen. So I've got plenty. All right, I'll be back. Okay, all gone. Found one more house, one more neighbor. So we're going to find a place to turn around and go home, maybe have some tea. It's a little wet. Hey guys, it's, I don't know. 115, 130, 145, something like that, before two o'clock on Tuesday, March 31st. And day, however many, I don't know, of stay at home because of the pandemic. Um, I spent the morning filming a couple of another another more couple of unexpected videos. I'm supposed to be cutting back on how many videos I film this year and post because um, my channel can be a bit overwhelming, but that hasn't happened yet. Um, so we've got a couple new videos, including one making uh, headbands with buttons on it for the nurses and doctors to save the backs of their ears. I have a friend who's a nurse and 
she was like, the backs of my ears are sore and bloody. And uh, I said, well, let me see what, what I have. So anyway, I did. Um, what else? I made a kids another kids art video. I was a few days behind in that, so I did that too. Um, I haven't managed to get anything else done today. There's a sink full of dirty dishes. The stove needs cleaning. I'll get it done. I don't know. Right now I gotta get the mail. It looks like some more coffee came in and I don't know what else. Yeah. It's a weird, weird time in all of our lives. It's very strange. Anyway, this is the only thing I feel safe doing without a mask on. I think um, this afternoon when we do go walking, I will probably start wearing a mask. Uh, it's just this whole thing is so weird. Anyway, all right, that's it for the moment. I'll be back. Make a point on my way outside of making sure Bambi had food. They've been hovering around the bowl most of the morning. So I knew they were hungry. Anyway, now they're having their snack. We're about halfway through our bag of deer corn, so when it's empty, I'm not sure how we're gonna get more. All right, I'll be back. We are headed out to go walking. I've got another five rocks to leave somewhere. I might leave them all in the library box. I don't know yet. I've got a surgical mask in my pocket in case I feel like I need it. And my inhaler, of course, cough drop. It's allergy season, so you know, besides everything else. Anyway, we're going to go get some walking in. Got another Kids Art video loaded to the channel. And another video that's directly related to the coronavirus outbreak. I don't know what else to say, but anyway, it's a sewing video. I might eventually put the two, the mask video and today's headband video into the sewing playlist. I don't know. We'll see. I'll be back. Hey guys, it is Wednesday, April 1st, April Fool's Day, only there's no jokes to be had today. <laughs> um, I don't know if you all follow me on social media and if you remember a couple months ago I found it was advertised as a Bad Boss Voodoo doll at a thrift shop. I'll insert a picture about here. I've taken it and decided to turn it into a positive affirmation doll. So my friend Mike Deacon has a Facebook group and He's been doing special art prompts for everybody around the world who is stuck in now because of the quarantine, because of the virus. And every day I am prompted by what he posts to think of a positive affirmation word and then print said word onto a little scrap of fabric and sew it to the doll. It's a goofy, crazy hot mess. It's gonna be cool when it's done. So I'm gonna enjoy that when it's done. Then I, at the same time, I bought a kit that was new and unopened called Gorgeously Gruesome Zombies. It came with some fabric and parts, and also mainly it came with this book on how to make these little felt dolls. And I don't know if you all remember back in the day, I used to make what's called a doty doll. And I'll try to put some pictures here if I can find some old pictures in my archive somewhere. And I forgot how much I like making them. So I took a couple of the patterns out of this book and I've um, blown them up a little bit to 125% um, size and printed them on cardstock. And I made my first little zombie. This is Miss Corona. <laughs> yeah, I forgot how much I like making these. So I spent today and made her too. So 
It's pretty cool. I did turn off my computer, which I have to turn back on again because I filmed working on the little voodoo doll, the positive affirmation doll. I filmed it, I edited it, and I'm I rendered it and everything, and I wanted to put it over on Patreon for the patrons over there. Only I forgot, so I gotta go put it over there now. Oops. Um, and I think we're gonna have fajitas for dinner. Nobody knows that yet but me, but we have some fajita chicken in the freezer and we should have tortillas and cheese and all of that stuff. I'll probably saute up some onions and peppers. Yeah, so I think that's what we're gonna have for dinner. Making it work with what we have. It's the name of the game in the coronavirus, right? Yeah, yeah. Anyways, what are you all up to? Oh, I also did find finding all these old crafts. I forgot how much I love making these little felt dolls. And I'm going to be making some more. I cut out four more little zombies. So I'm going to make some more. Um, and then when I was looking for stuff, I found this strawberry pin cushion kit. I don't know where it came from. I think somebody gave it to me. I don't remember who. I don't know, but I'm going to um, I'm going to open it up before I go downstairs. Make sure there's a needle in here, and I might do this downstairs when I'm on the sofa tonight. Um, and I have a bunch of needlework kits too that I found, so I think I'm going to be working on stuff like that. Forgotten, forgotten art, right? So yeah. All right. What are you finding in your stash in your house that you've forgotten about or you've been putting off? you've been purposefully neglecting <laughs> to do and occupy your time with while we're all stuck in. I'd love to know. I'll leave something down in the comments. All right, I'm gonna get that video loaded and I will be back. It's, to out today, oh. <laughs> it's okay, dear. <laughs> all right, so we're out for another walk, getting some fresh air and exercise in while we, while we can as safely as possible. I've decided to uh, name my first little zombie doll, Miss Coronavirus. <laughs> and I already have a idea for another one, so they're fun to make, so I'm gonna keep making them. Anyway, I'll try to find a link for the um, zombie kid if I can find one. I think it was originally from Target, so I'm not sure if it's available or not, I don't know. But I'll look and see. And. Anyway, we're going to go take Spaz, a.k.a. Lily the puppy, out for a walk, and we'll be back. They're all here, see? It's Thursday evening. I haven't vlogged at all today. I forgot until just now. She's trying to hide from the camera, see? <laughs> it's Polyus' birthday. Everybody, every, everybody say happy birthday. And Lily, you see her? Lily's birthday. Yeah, she's down there begging for a piece of the cheesecake that Becca made. See? Yes. Happy birthday, Lily. It's my birthday. She's three. Yeah. And begging for human food. Yes, we did feed her, but she's still hungry. Go figure. <laughs> see? Look. She's like, ooh, cheesecake. That's dog food, right? <laughs> Crazy dog. All right, so... We're out for our evening walk. I have a mask. As soon as we start to see humans, I'll be putting it on. Um, human. You are, but you don't count. I live with you. Okay. <laughs> anyway, I got some more face masks made today. Some more like this. I have a particular friend who was in desperate need. And so I got her some made and sent off and then decided to make some in this style for the boys in the house. I have this feeling we should already be wearing them out in public around other people. The boys don't like to hear that, neither does my daughter, but I have a feeling a strongly worded recommendation is coming quickly if it isn't here yet already. Anyway, enough of that nonsense. Let's go get a walk-in, shall we? I'll be glad I put my mask on. We just ran into a runner who doesn't understand social distancing. So I was able to step to the side, but yeah, that's not the point. All right, we're gonna keep going on our walk. I'll be back. So we don't know if those were ducks or geese. My husband thinks they were one of the two. I don't know. 
I know they were loud, yeah. I know about as much about birds as I do plants, which isn't saying much. Uh, if it's not a succulent, I might have trouble keeping it alive. I know a lot more about art supplies, but you know, no big surprise to those of you who know me. All right, I'll be back. If it's not the geese, it's the bullfrogs. They stop as soon as we come up to them. I don't see him. I can hear him, but we could hear him till like we walked up here. I think it's cool. Hmm. I don't know. Hey guys, it's Friday afternoon, 421 p.m. I forgot to vlog again today. Uh, but your life is just weird right now. Um, anyway, I made another zombie doll today. <laughs> I'll insert a picture here. Um, um, yeah, I'll um, be making a few more of them. They're fun to make and a great way to work out what's going on. And what else? There's not much else except laundry. <laughs> I am. Good morning. It is Saturday morning, April 4th, I think. Um, Thursday was the 2nd, or, yeah, 4th. It's 10.29 a.m. We're getting ready to head out to go look for supplies. <laughs> Such a big deal. Um, both groups of couples we're going out in pairs have the same list we both have masks and all of that stuff hand sanitizer the kids have to get some stuff um, for the construction that's hopefully still going on at their house but they're going to see what they can get um and also try to get some other supplies so they've got the same list we do and um we're not going for groceries. We're looking for the things that we couldn't get last week, i.e. toilet paper, Clorox wipes, Lysol spray, hand sanitizer. If we can f find a few bonus things that we use a lot of, like um, our favorite vitamin water and stuff like that, we'll pick up, if we're in a place that has that and they, ha and they have that stock, we will get some, but it's not our, fo our focus today. We're gonna also try to go out um, and Lily is here, so I have to spell it W-A-L-K-ing. Um, there may or may not be some uh, walking trails that are still open. We're not actually sure. Um, they are starting to close things. And we do want to maintain social distance and do our, our share and stay home as much as possible, which we've been doing. At the same time, if we can go walking and there's no one else around or not too many people, and we can be six feet minimum apart, have our masks on and all of that. And we're gonna go get some fresh air. Um, so that's what's our agenda today. I guess, I don't know if you can see the little black shadow right there. I think she wants O-U-T. So I'm gonna go do that and I'll be back. So hey guys, yes it's us, we're out for another walk. 
we did a lot of walking already at the shops and stuff, but, and uh, down by the river, but we didn't get to take Lily with us, so she was looking at us pitifully and we didn't know how to say no. Right? So anyway, that's the end of an interesting week. I think we're going to have more interesting weeks than not going forward. <laughs> Hopefully they're good interesting and not bad interesting, but I guess we'll see. Anyway, I'm going to put my mask back up. I'm going to continue my walk. I hope you all stay safe, stay healthy, stay creative. Don't forget if you have any questions or comments or concerns for either one of us, leave them down below. And um, if you want to support the free content here on YouTube and over in the Facebook art groups, I have a lot of ways to do that in the video description, as do all of my other art friends. So if you're a fan of one of the other art channels, do check out their video description. If they don't have anything there, send them a message and ask or make a comment on a video and ask. That's it for now. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. We'll see you next week. Go out and have a great day. Have a great week. Do something nice for yourself because you deserve it. We'll see you later. Bye, guys.